It's a real pleasure to say a few words about Dan Ellsberg. Uh, he's an individual that I first came across during the trial on the Pentagon Papers uh, in Los Angeles, uh, right there at the courthouse. And ever since, I have followed uh, his uh, very interesting journey through life, his contributions, his courage, and most particularly his knowledge. In recent years, I've had the occasion to spend many, many hours talking to Dan, particularly on the telephone. He knows everything, at least it appears that way. And when I ask him a question, usually it's at least 15 minutes before we get a pause. But it's knowledgeable, it's coherent, it's interesting. And in this age, maybe every age, where the herd mentality, the conventional wisdom, uh, people going along to get along, Dan stands out. He stands out uh, for his clarity, uh, for his individualism, uh, for sincerity. Uh, great courage, great humanity, uh, just a, a good human being and a good friend. Uh, I, I'm really glad that he's getting this recognition. Uh, I hope that it will lead to more people reading his book, uh, The Doomsday Machine, and uh, coming in contact with his very uh, cogent analysis and insight into where the world has been, where the world may be going. Listen to Dan Ellsberg. And with this recognition, hopefully many, many will. Thank you.